Hey everybody, Digibro here. Comments about the beard will be deleted, and I'm here to talk to you about anime that I love. A lot of people have been saying lately that uh, I should do more videos about anime that I really love because I've been doing all these long series about shows that I don't like, such as the Asterisk War Sucks. I just had that really big video about uh, the problems with meta in anime. Um, I'm already famous for my Sword Art Online videos, and I've got a few more videos on the way that are pretty negative about some very popular currently airing shows. And a lot of the reason that this is happening right now is that I didn't used to ever talk about negative shows, actually. For the first year of my uh, anime video career, I really only ever talked about negative shows once when I talked about Sword Art Online. It just so happens that those videos tend to be by far the most popular, um, and therefore most people know me better as a guy who makes negative videos. Uh, and also because my channel wasn't very big back when I was doing a lot of those positive reviews, then a lot of people haven't gone back to watch them. A lot of people don't know that all those positive reviews were done in the past. And you can't necessarily tell just by reading a video title what stuff I love and what stuff I don't. You know, if you were going back through my videos, you'd just see me talking about shows, not necessarily whether those shows are good or bad right in the title. Though, nowadays you could probably tell because I've changed the way I title videos to more reflect that. But, uh, I just thought I'd go through and if there's, you know, if, if you want to see more positive content from me, there's a really good chance you haven't seen a lot of these videos I've made about uh, stuff I love because the view counts simply <laughs> reflect that there's no way that a lot of you have. So, uh, I'm just going to list a bunch of videos I've made about shows that I loved. Uh, first one I ever did, Samurai Champloo. First major anime video I did, show that I absolutely loved, talk about what's so great about it. I've done a video on The Wind Rises, which is a movie that I was a really big fan of. I have done a video on, uh, Little Busters, which was a pretty okay show. Uh, I did a six-part series on Serial Experiments Lane, so if you're looking for more of these big, long series that I tend to do, uh, I have the series on Lane that wasn't very watched because, again, it was really, really early into me doing anime videos. So, uh, not a lot of people know about it. There's a whole playlist for it right on the front of my channel. If you go through my playlists, you know, there'll, there'll be lists list of all the uh, videos I've done. Uh, I did Log Horizon, 22-minute video on that, one of my top uh, 10 favorite anime of all time. I've got a 30-minute video on the Ghost in the Shell franchise, which I'm a really big fan of. I've got... Um, I initially did a 10 minute video on Psychopass. Uh, that video is okay, but really, my Psychopass vs. Psychopass 2 video series is one of my favorites that I've ever done. I think it's, you know, like second only to the Asterisk War or uh, the Hideaki Anno series in terms of um, quality of my videos. It was me talking about both the first and second seasons of Psychopass and comparing them. So a lot of it is a negative review of Psychopaths 2, but then it also is a positive review of Psychopaths 1. So it's really breaking down both shows. Psychopaths is one of my favorite anime series, so that's an extremely positive uh, video. Um, I've got a video about... I've got a few videos about Space Dandy, which I'm a big fan of. I've got three in total. One is Observations on Space Dandy Season 1. One of them is uh, Kill La Kill and Space Dandy, Embracing the Unquantifiable, two shows I love that I talked about in the same video, and a third video I had uh, called Dandy the Man with No Past or something like that. I've got, uh, again, videos on Kill La Kill, one about the style of narrative that it has and how it's a uh, very layered and meta narrative. Um, I've got a video about... I'm just, I'm literally looking at my videos and naming all the positive ones. I've got a 53-minute video on the Monogatari franchise, which I'm a very uh, big fan of. I broke down everything up through Hana Monogatari, which was, uh, at the time, the latest one that had come out. Um, I still have not watched the later seasons, which is why I haven't done a follow-up to that. But, uh, that's a pretty huge video. Um... I've got a video about One Piece and why that works so well. I'm sure most of you have seen my One Piece video because it's one of the biggest ones on the channel. Um, I've got a video about Madoka Magica, which I'm not the the world's biggest fan of, but I did really like it, and I talked about it at a lot of length. Um, I've got a video about Fate Zero, which I'm a, uh, yeah, I'd say I'm a pretty big fan of. Um, 
I've got an eight-part video series on Kata no Kyokai, which is actually, like, the least viewed thing on my channel. No one has watched this. Again, there's a playlist for it um, on the main page. It's sort of weird. It's, it's a very esoteric style of video. I guess Lane is, too. But this one, again, if you want multi-part series about shows I really love, I am a huge fan of Kata no Kyokai, and I did eight videos on it uh, consecutively, one day after another. Um, I actually have a video about my top 10 favorite anime, though it's very outdated now, so I wouldn't, uh, take it to be up to date. Had a short video about Kaiba, which is a show I liked. Uh, my Let's Watch of Ponyo. I did a whole commentary on the movie Ponyo, which is my favorite animated film. I did a, a, a whole commentary track. You can listen to it while watching the movie. And it'll, uh, you know, I'll just comment on what's going on and stuff like that. A video about Bakuman and Blue Blazes. One of those is a live action show, but I'm a big fan of both. I've got a video about The Borrower Arietti, which is one of my favorite movies. I've got a video about Tamako Market, which I'm a big fan of. I've got a video about Lucky Star that I'm a big fan of. Then I have a huge video, uh, two-parter on k -On, which, as many of you know, is my favorite anime of all time. It's two huge 45-minute parts. Um, there's just a redirect to it on this channel because uh, I had a bunch of copyright restrictions at the time. And the uh, a lot of these are audio only. A lot of my older stuff, I didn't know how to get stuff past copyright, so I had to resort to just doing audio with no video. Um, but this K-On! video is enormous, and it's super in-depth, and it's about my favorite show. So if you wanted... You know, a lot of people say, like, why not do a super long series about a show you love? Well, I did. It was on k -On. Um, I have a whole 20-part video series of my top 20 anime of 2015. Wait, 2015? No, 2014. My top 20 anime of 2014. There's a whole playlist for all of those. Um, I have this video that was about uh, Hyoka, Jinro, and Nagi no Asukara because it was like a Secret Santa thing I did. I talked about Jinro a lot in that, which is one of my favorite movies as well. Um, I have a video about Hunter x Hunter 2011 and why that's so good. Most of you have probably seen that. It's pretty big. My Gurren Lagann and Kill La Kill video, which is also pretty big. Those are both shows that I consider 10 out of 10 shows. Um, my light novel trends video, which kind of got adapted into my recent very successful uh, video about anime meta. Like... Most of the information in that kind of calls back to my video about light novel trends, which starts off talking about a bunch of my favorite light novels and then moves into, uh, you know, the territory that I covered in that newer video. Um, did a video about uh, No Kome, which is sort of a goofy video, but I did like that show. Um, a 30-minute analysis of Spirited Away, which is a phenomenal anime film that I'm sure most of you have seen and I really love. Um, a couple videos about video games I like a lot. I did a video about F A Tale of Memories, which is a show I really like that was at one point, um, like my favorite anime back in like 2007. Um, video on the early part of Hebe K Euphonium, which I really enjoyed. I'm just going through all of these. This video, uh, a bunch of stuff about Evangelion. A lot of people will always ask me why haven't I continued my Ava series. It was never planned as a series. I think I've been over this, but like... There are There's a ton of Ava videos that talk in-depth about what's so good about Ava, which is one of my favorites. Um, the one about Watamote, which is pretty positive. That one's also really popular, so you've probably seen it. Um, my video about Mario Kada, just sort of celebrating her writing style. Three videos about Lyrical Nanoha, doing an entire retrospective of the franchise. I do like the Nanoha franchise for the most part. Um... Video about Do Da Da Da, which is a show I'm a big fan of. Video about Yu Yu Hakusho, which I'm a big fan of. Um, my five things that I want from anime romance video is basically a thinly veiled review of Kare Kano and how great that show is. Like, <laughs> all of it kind of builds up to, and here's the show that did it all perfectly, and it's Kare Kano. Uh, my two-part Hideyuki Anno video talks about a lot of shows that I like in the course of it. So yeah, that's all of the uh, positive anime, and of course, uh, the Konosuba video that I just did the other day, which is, you know, hugely popular, so you've probably seen it. So yeah, those are all videos I've done about shows that I love. If you are sick of all the negativity that's coming through my channel right now, and you want m to hear me talking about shows that are great, shows that I highly recommend, uh, check out all those videos, and, uh, you know, just have fun. I like the shows. Check them all out. And in the future, 
Maybe I'll title all of my videos, like, Best Anime Ever This Show, like uh, Best Guy Ever Did with his Best Anime Ever Gurren Lagann video, which, incidentally, I will uh, probably never do another video on Gurren Lagann because Best Guy Ever's Gurren Lagann video said everything you could possibly ever say. Alright, enjoy. Have fun.